Hi guys, it's uh, not hi. No, no. <coughs> hey guys, it's Ace. Welcome to Smore Terraria. It's been a while since I've recorded this, and um, in the time that we were gone, I did quite a bit of things not beneficial, except for uh, the water walking boots and the climbing claws. Those were beneficial, and I got those. And I'll tell you in a sec. So um, why I was gone for so long is I was being stupid. Uh, average ace every day, you know, I'm always stupid. Uh, so I went and I was like, yo, let's get a new world because, like, we have a lot of corruption in this world. Not going to lie. Let's just, let's just show you since you can see. Not that. That's weird. I don't get that one. Corruption. Corruption. Uh, let's see, over here somewhere, more corruption, so three areas of corruption. Now, I remembered something, that there is a Clantaminator, and that's a hard mode item, but that can stop the corruption. So I'm looking forward to be, you know, using that, because that's going to be useful. But today we got to organize our chests and make a storage room below. Oh man, and this is going to be difficult. Very difficult indeed. Um, well, yeah, I, I guess I'll go right here. Sorry, furnace. Okay, so we're digging. What? What am I doing? Silly me. Oh, no, this is good. Okay. Okay, so we're going to dig a hole down to here. Uh, I've been down here before actually to uh, patch up like some clay or whatever uh, so this is gonna be the storage room and I'm going to be building this today so we're gonna take out all this stuff we're of course going to need to replace everything with whatever we need. we're gonna use brick uh, have you ever used well, first of all have you ever played Terraria before if so, uh, have you ever used the brick? This, like, gray brick, I think it is. Super easy to get, but nobody ever uses it. They always use raw materials for their houses, like wood or stone, and I kind of got annoyed at that. So, in my world on the uh, PlayStation, or PS3, yeah, that, that seems more formal for some reason, um, in my world on the PS3, we actually, uh, me and my sister, because well, that's who I play with on the PS3, uh, we made our basement out of gray brick, and I loved it so much, I was like, what? This stuff exists? Yay! I don't think this is centered. Yeah, it's not centered. Let's see, one, two, one, two, three, four, five, six, okay. Oops, no. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, possibly just five on this side. Well, we could always fix that by going over here, but I think no. No, no thanks. Um, that's okay. I'm okay with it being just a little bit uneven. For now, at least. We can always change it. Um, so, let me make sure to put up uh, sides. Not sides. Torches on the side. Let me finish this next layer, of course. There we go. Okay. So we got torches hanging. Grass is spreading. <laughs> this isn't fun. Um. Oh dang it! Our furnace. Uh. So we're going to. Oh well. Basically, I went to into another world that had a corruption. No, not a corruption. A crimson. And for all I know, it could have been just as much like crimson as it was corruption in this world, but um, oh, this is going surprisingly fast this time, weird, okay, we're also going to need quite a bit of this gray brick, because we're also going to be making walls out of it too, I think, probably, um, let's see, so, now that we found this, I'm going to remove this, 
There we go. Keep going. Oops, no, no. I do not want to remove workbench. That was not part of the deal. There we go. Okay. And uh, this is this is going to remain here, but I'm going to place gray brick this time. So let's do that. Ah, uh, it's blending so well. Yeah, gray brick is a good thing to have. Uh oh, oh, is, did I make? That's okay. We're gonna add this to the bottom too. Uh oh. So we put that on the bottom there. Okay, I'm I'm just gonna build this off camera. I'll be back in a second when I'm done. Okay, guys, I'm back. And the basement is finished, pretty much. I haven't put everything in the chests yet, but this is, I guess, not really the basement, more the storage room, you know. We can't exactly do anything but store things in here. So this is the storage room, that's what I'm going to call it. And uh, I go over here, and a traveling merchant came. What's his name? A frame. Man. And they're always in the water, too. They're either fires or morse. Okay. Extendo grip. Foe. Fancy dishes. Katana. We've seen all this. Mysterious cape. And yeah, I wonder what it does. Okay, we'll look into that later once he comes again. And if there's something from him that we can get that's really, you know, it's really worth something. Um. So, uh, another thing I wanted to do today was make a fishing pole, or I don't know, maybe not. Uh, one second. Do we have any glass on us right now? Uh, I gotta go find some glass. Because, see, this is why we need uh, better stuff. Um, yeah, where the heck is the glass? Oh, there's some sand. Just gather a bunch of sand, then. Aww. Okay. Should be good. We shouldn't need that much. Seriously. Um, so now we're going to go to the second floor. What the, what the glitch, man? Oh, craft window. There we go. Glass. And craft a bunch of glass. Okay, that's all the glass we can cook. Uh, so... Um, what we need is a terrarium, I think. Can we craft that just out of glass? What's that glass wall? Where the heck is the terrarium? Maybe we need an anvil? Special crafting table or something? Oh, stop. So I want to do this. Oh, so I did terrarium. Here we go. Terrarium. 16 glass. Okay, I think we can craft two of those. So I want to go fishing for sure. I'm going to make the fishing rod right now because why not? Uh, we have the iron for it. Since the iron isn't really useful in this in this world. Uh, oh, uh, yep. Yeah, I was going to talk... Uh, about the stuff I found, uh, I got the climbing claws and the water walking boots from when I was trying to find a living tree, you know those cool things, the living tree. I was trying to find the underground thing so we could make our home out of a living tree. But uh, yeah, no, I didn't end up finding that. Um, so now we gotta get stuff with this terrarium. I saw a worm and I probably killed it, but maybe not, so let's go see. I saw a worm out here somewhere. See if there's any worm. I don't think we can use bunnies, but we can catch them. We can catch a bunny in a terrarium. Okay, come out, come out, wherever you are. I want to kill him, I guess. Uh, oh, goodbye. <laughs> okay. Let's see. Let's let's get rid of this. It's gross. That's when we didn't have things that we could double jump with. Okay, this. Just keep on digging. Man, what am I doing? Am I just spider web? Whoa, why am I mining so fast? <laughs> I 
<laughs> I love this web slinger. It's, I, I would nominate it as the best grappling hook in the game. It's just so hilarious. You can cast that many webs. Apparently, if you combine it with a uh, jungle grappling hook, those things, you know. See, look, look how fast you can do it. I am the Spider-Man. Okay. Uh, terrarium. We need to find something from somebody, and maybe we we don't have any bait at the moment, and we need to find that bait. I think worms. Well, obviously. I, what is we doing over there? You crazy? Okay. There's a bunny. You want? I just want to show you what it what it looks like to catch a bunny. Can we, can we even catch him? Hello. I'd like to catch you in this terrarium. What the heck? Catch the bunny! Okay, I guess you can't catch everything. Well, dang it. Oh, bird. Can you catch the bird? We can't catch the bird. Dang it. Can you catch a worm or something? I thought it was in a terrarium. I'm gonna have to look up how to fish, really. I'm really gonna have to do that right now. Oh, zombie. Man. Okay. I guess I'll be right back. Hey guys, it's Ace. Uh, so we've made it all the way here. Oh look, it's raining. Awesome. So if we find anything, that's really good because rain increases your chance. <sighs> so bug net really didn't prove to be that useful. There was not a single bug anywhere. Oh man, I just shivered to be found. And all we've got is this stupid reinforced fishing pole. And jellyfishes, you need a jellyfish jar, uh, apparently. So dang it, pretty much. Um, I don't know what to do. Let's see, we have 37 coins, so I don't know. Let's just see if they really do need a jellyfish jar. Nope, that's not a myth. Well, I guess I'll kill him then. Dang it. Uh, I have the tab open. One second, let me kill him. Oh, cool, ghost stick. Okay, I have the tab open on my iPad, so let's see what the kind of things are. Okay, let's go back, because I have the bug net bait. Okay. So, uh, they're like grasshoppers, scorpions, snail, glowing snail, worm, black scorpion, firefly. That is something that we could pursue, a firefly. Those are pretty common, so let's go back to there. And uh, it actually has not bad, uh, it has 20% power, which isn't bad. 20% uh, is quite a lot in this game. Uh, let's kill him. Rain hood guy. Oh, this is the ocean music, by the way. And, uh, if you like the ocean music. Uh, I'll have to go soon, but... Did I really get another raincoat? We're running out of inventory space. By the way, I found some platinum just laying on the surface. Uh, <laughs> am I tripping? <laughs> I don't know. Um, also, just a bunch of different butterflies are pretty good. Jellyfish, of course. Uh, there's some others that you can catch from the guy who floats in the ocean. I found one of them floating on the ocean, by the way. Costling. Um, oh, look who we just found. Well, see, this is the guy I was talking about. He's supposed to be floating on the ocean after a lot of fishing. He's just, like, right here. Great helper, minion. So rich, deep in the caverns, there's a fish made of gemstones. That's all. So he asked me to catch a jewel fish. So this guy's, like, a quest giver for fishing. So you can get incredibly, like, into the whole fishing thing. But one thing I'm upset that he doesn't have is stuff like... Oh, well, he's... Izzy is his name. Or her. I don't know. Dang it. Uh, I'm not really sure if we have a space for you to live, Izzy. Uh, I might have to teleport home. But uh, anyway, for now, I am uh, actually have to go for a bit. So I'll see you guys once I get back. Hopefully we'll catch some bugs. Hey, guys. It's Ace. <coughs> and we're back with some more Terraria. I don't know if the last episode or last part of the episode, if I like stopped. Oh no, I think I did. Yeah. So uh, 
this is like a day later so um, I'm gonna try fishing for the first time now it's kind of late at night which uh, I looked at the wiki about fishing and that does not help you much you know you don't get as much fishing power if it's late at night but you do get it if it's like in the evening or something okay so water walking boots are super useful and also pretty rare um, that jellyfish we're not gonna be able to kill it if we do it's not gonna give us anything um, so uh, I guess I could technically yeah, put up a torch can I put a torch on the water that'd be so cool if you have water walking boots um, so anyway we're gonna try fishing for the first time ever I have never fished before or watched any videos of it. Well, I kind of have. I've watched a uh, hero this video of it. So I've got a bunch of bait in my inventory. Um, worms. I noticed the best way to d get them was by uh, you, f you know, those little things on the ground. Not like that. Don't break that. But uh, it's like those little chunky things, like the uh, mossy, like oh no, don't let Timmy die. Oh, is that a black lens? I don't care about Timmy anymore. I want sunglasses. One second, Timmy. There we go. No, oh, stop killing him. He's poor and young and whatever. He likes to order me around. Out there. Hey, you. I'm going to encase you in something. There we go. Don't move. So, uh, this probably isn't the best use of our ammo, so hopefully we'll be using the grasshoppers, which only have a 10% bait power. And, um, yeah, hopefully we're only going to be using those when we randomly do the fishing. So I'll try my best, put them right here. Uh, so I caught a bunch of grasshoppers, worms. Worms are, worms are pretty good for how lucky they are. You know, they're not hard to get. Um, oh, hi there. I guess rare would be the right word for how lucky they are. Uh, yeah. Let's go back to the ocean. It has the coolest music. Right, come on, bunny. There we go. I just love catching the random animals. That's so fun. Because, you know, it's like random animals. Cool. Uh, so we're going to go fishing now, finally. Okay. Reinforced fishing pole. 50% fishing power requires bait to catch. And, uh, this is a big ocean. Let's go. Hello? It's not supposed to be this slow, is it? Uh, yeah, I think it's says, like, we drag a line in this one chance we have to lose weight. Uh, hopefully that didn't happen right there. Um, oh, man. Fishing? I don't know exactly if you need to put, like, the bait on the rod or something. Hmm, let's see. I know it says like there's 25, but... Uh... Okay, that's a firefly. That's also pretty good. Just as good as the worm. Uh, put this one here? No. Of course, bait to catfish. Do we put it in our ammo slot? No, it doesn't... St oh, what about our snowballs? Okay, whatever. Um... With crab. We catch him in a bug net. Okay, no. It'd be cool if you could have like a hermit crab or something. Okay. We can go fishing out in the deep ocean now. Does that prove us no lock? Okay. Or you could like go over here and toss it. Okay. I think it has something attached. No, it really doesn't look like it. <laughs> Oh, a red snapper. Cool. Material. Okay, that's cool. So that's just a fish we can maybe save for later. Let's put this in here. Red snapper. Okay. So it's working. Uh, I didn't use this for cricket, though. But ease up the worm. I think, yeah, ease up the worm. A zombie. I got a zombie arm. Awesome. This thing is really useful.